This is it, your bachelorette weekend. We have been dreaming about this moment since the first day of freshman year. We are gonna be swimming in dick, girl. At its core, this film is really about good friends, five true friends that have kind of, you know, lived their lives and gone in different directions and as, as we all do, and come back together in this, with these, in this crazy circumstance, but realize that, you know, they're their, I think, best version of themselves when they can see themselves reflected in, in their truest friends. I just got some coke from the busboy. What? Yeah. America. Yeah. Already? Yeah. Sort of right on the nose. Yeah. Yes. Now we're talking. Yes. Okay. 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 okay, guys, I can't do any cocaine. I'm very jet lagged, so I will do cocaine. Yes. There's also something very beautiful about the ritual of a bachelorette party, as ugly and weird as they can get. It's like your wedding is maybe the most, one of the top three most important times in your life, and the impulse to gather around you, all of the people who've ever meant a lot to you, is um, beautiful. Okay, before we go, we gotta do human frentipede, yeah? What is a human frentipede? It's a photo we always take that's like the movie Human Centipede, where they're sewn together, mouth to bum, but it's with friends, so it's special. You know, that's how you know who your friends are, people who are still around when things don't go well. You know, mm. it's easy to hang out and have drinks and dance right. around, but <laughs> when something bad happens, you know, and you see who sticks around and who's still there for you, I mean, that's what friendship is all about, right? Ah! Did anybody see me fall? Everybody no. saw. No, yeah. Ellen, yeah. you fell. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah, his junk broke my fall. I mean, I've like watched a lot of movies where I'm relating, or TV shows where I'm relating to a male protagonist. It's not crazy because we're the same species, so I can feel, you know, I can relate to the character. So it, it's, it's, it's pretty easy to fully lock into the ride of this movie and just go for it, because it's so funny. It's really genderless, and, and there are parts in there that are that are super feminine or masculine, but it's like a really, uh, it's its a delicate balance. I probably have HPV now. Whatever, we all have HPV. I don't have HPV. If you've had sex after the year 1991, then you do have HPV. Oh, then I have like a shit ton of HPV. 